style of conveyance belt, uh, starting like this with a pillar style, and then you have a string over your upper arm and your forearm. In your right hand is the palm grip or loop if you have it, but I actually prefer palm grip. And then your string pulls down here on your wrist kind of like this and your wand uh, goes out automatically in a horizontal position. And then uh, the next part of the movement is push in your non-dominant hand because it's actually a non-dominant arm. So you push in your hand, it rolls over on this surface, then you push in your other hand and it's like that. Look how I'm tying my left hand completely and um, the string is over both hands and then I can easily push in my right elbow so it's also very safe here so it's in a vertical position again and then I start and pull down my left hand again and I pull on the string so it comes in the front and it's again in this position I pull more with my left hand it's here like this and then I can help here with my right hand to push it over and it's like this again okay so the most important thing is to have it in one plane. It's the wall plane here, right here. And you can always stick in your hand, your elbow, your other elbow, like this. <laughs> um, and if you want, you can also turn. You can also catch it again so that's something you can practice if you're not really feeling that you always keep the plane if you want to do this it's the same movement just behind your back you can start going into fish tails from here and always try to keep your planes and then you can do every contact move better